And melanoma, it's one of the three types of skin cancer, squamous cell, basal cell, and melanoma. It's a, it's a skin cancer of the pigmented cells that we all have in our skin. Unfortunately, it is recognized as the most serious form that's more likely to spread. In your case, Bud, you had what they, they called a stage three, and I assume that, that that was based just that it was a big lesion. Mm -hmm. That as you can see, this lesion was the, was the size of a 50 cent piece, mm -hmm. which is pretty big. And what we have to do with a melanoma, as you know okay. better as well as I do, that you have to do what is called a wide excision and you need to get margins mm -hmm. of clear tissue around this to make sure that you're removing all of it. That is the treatment for melanoma, so your surgeon, what he did was, you know, plan a surgery like so to remove that, and they go down to the lining of the bone because melanoma can, you know, can go to your, your blood vessels. I'm glad you're showing that, Drew, because a lot of people think, oh, you just, you know, you get that mole removed. No, you're... You're getting any surrounding tissue anywhere it may have spread. You gotta get rid of all exactly. of it. Exactly, you have to go deep and you have to go to those margins. And I know they put a skin graft on that for you that they, they took from your abdomen. Correct. And if there's a lesson to learn, you already touched on it, uh, Dr. Travis, is, is if you see a lesion, don't ignore it. And one of the key things with any skin cancer that you wanna look for, number one, asymmetries. That means the two halves of the lesion, you know, are not exactly the same. Uh, B is borders. Typically with a melanoma, the borders are irregular. They're, they're not exactly crystal clear. C, the, the color typically with melanomas, it's a dark shaded pigmented color, but very often it has different shades mixed in with it. D, diameter, the size. Typically melanomas are larger than other skin cancers, and finally E, evolving, meaning that this is something that's changing, that you've seen it go from one color or size or shape to another. Those are all key signs that this may be uh, a skin cancer. And so here you are battling breast cancer, battling skin cancer. Can you give us an update on what, what the prognosis is for the two of you and your health? Well, we're both right now cancer-free. They have... Uh... <laughs> They've removed any affected tissue, affected tissue and um, Dolly has finished her chemotherapy, uh, is in her radiation, and um, I'll begin my chemotherapy soon and will require no radiation. We can't thank you enough for sharing your story and best of, of luck with the rest of your treatment and our best to the boys.